Hello, my name is Joshua Brown for the Interview Training Company, howtobecome.com. And in this presentation, I will teach you how to pass your Mersey Rail interview. So if you have a train operating company interview coming up for Mersey Rail and you need to prepare for both the most common and tough competency and behavioral interview questions for any role at Mersey Rail, then please make sure you watch this video from start to finish because I'm gonna help you to stand out and succeed. To achieve that goal, this is what I'll cover. I'll start off by giving you a list of Mersey Rail interview questions questions that I strongly recommend you prepare for. I'll then provide you with example high scoring answers to those questions to help you to succeed. Plus I'll also make sure to give you some essential tips for passing your Mersey Rail interview before finally telling you how you can download further resources including all of the answers to help you to prepare. And just very quickly, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I want to help you to pass your Mersey Rail interview and I can only do that if you are subscribed. And please don't forget to hit that like button because this tells me you find these tutorials useful. Okay, let's take a look at that first Mersey Rail interview question to prepare for, which is introduce yourself. Now, this interview question is the very first question that you're going to have to answer during your Mersey Rail interview, and it's your chance to start positive and be that standout candidate. So use this opportunity to talk about the skills and qualities you have. Don't talk about your home life or your personal life unless it's relevant to the job role itself. Instead, focus on your experience and the passion you have for working in the job role and how you're going to add value to Mersey role as a company, as an organization. You can use the competencies and align them with your own to achieve that. And another great tip here is to get a copy of that job description from the job advert and look at the skills and qualities that they are after. Highlight them and then match them to your own skills and qualities in your answers. So for example, if on the job description they state they're seeking someone who's safety focused with great communication abilities, then throughout your Mersey Row interview answers, be sure to use those exact terms. So let's take a look at a brilliant top scoring answer to help you. Introduce yourself. Thank you for inviting me to be interviewed for this position today. My name is Joshua and I would describe myself as someone who is self-disciplined, versatile and collaborative. I have a passion for the railway industry, hence I'm eager to apply for this position at Mersey Rail and positively contribute to Mersey Rail's dedication in offering outstanding customer service, cutting edge travel experiences and providing a safe and dependable service to its passengers. Throughout my career, I've developed various transferable skills and experiences that will enable me to excel in this role. I'm a highly positive and effective employee who thrives in customer focused environments. During my time in previous positions, I learned to fully understand the importance of consistently maintaining high customer satisfaction standards. Without the customer, there would be no company. So every member of the team must work towards providing a high level of service. I'm confident that my attentiveness, dedication and ability to collaborate effectively in a team would make me a valuable asset to Mersey Rail. I'm excited about the opportunity to contribute to the company's mission of providing safe and efficient train services across the UK. Wow, what a powerful way to kickstart your interview and be that standout candidate. Remember, by giving a confident answer like this to this opening interview question, introduce yourself or it may be worded as tell me about yourself, not only will you impress the manager but you'll also gain confidence in the rest of your answers to come okay let's take a look at the next Mersey Rail interview question which is what do you know about Mersey Rail as an organization so you must showcase that you've done plenty of research about the company take a look at Mersey Rail's website take a look at their about us page any latest news stories they have and take a look at their social media channels you can then impress the hiring manager by sharing facts about the company because this shows that you truly care about the company and you're not just interested in a paycheck. So here's a great example answer to help you. What do you know about Mersey Rail as an organisation? Mersey Rail is part of the transport network Transport UK, formerly known as Abellio, and also partnered with Serco. Transport UK includes a number of bus companies and train operating companies such as Great Anglia, West Midlands Railway and London North Western Railway. The bus services include Abilio London and Abilio RR, Rail Replacement. Mersey Rail employs over 1,200 people in varied and essential roles to ensure the rail network efficiently operates over 800 services each day, managing 68 stations. The network stretches from Chester as far north as Southport. The company also shares the four core values of Transport UK – genuine, professional, proactive and inclusive. And I also share these values, and if I am successful with my application, I will look forward to demonstrating these values in my role to support my colleagues and provide a professional and first-class service to the customers. 
Now don't go anywhere as I still have more interview questions and answers to give you. But when you're ready, click that link in the top right hand corner. It will take you through to my website, howtobecome.com, where you can download my 35 Mersey Row interview questions and answers for all job roles to give you the edge in your interview, including the ones that we're covering right now. Okay, here's the next Mersey Rail interview question for you. What have you done to prepare for this interview? Now this interview question is being asked as the interview panel wants to see that you really want this job and that you care about the company. If you haven't done much to prepare, it shows that you don't really care about the position and that you're just interested in a paycheck. Instead, show you've done your research about the company, that you planned ahead for the interview and be smart in your answer by highlighting that you're a great match for the job role itself. So let's take a look at a brilliant example answer to help you. What have you done to prepare for this interview? Before applying for this role, I have undertaken a number of steps. The first step I took was to research Mersey Rail in depth, the values of the company, the organisation structure and what will be expected of me in the position I am applying for. Once I had completed my research, I committed to applying for this position as I firmly believe that I'm not only a strong candidate for this position, as I have a number of related skills and strengths which are relevant to the job role, but I also share the organisation's values and demonstrate many of them on a day-to-day -day basis already. As I have been in full-time employment with the same company for some time now, I recognise that my interview skills might be a little lacking. So to help me get up to speed, I undertook a number of mock interviews with my friends to help me work on my body language and speaking voice. Before coming to the interview today, I also made a number of journeys to the interview location to ensure that I was fully aware of the best route to take and the length of time it would take to get to the interview location. Even today before leaving, I checked the local travel news to see if there were any delays on the route. I left half an hour earlier this morning than needed, so I arrived for the interview in good time. I have put in much preparation for this interview today, as I really do feel like this position is an ideal fit for me, and I'm excited to discuss this opportunity with you further today. Okay, the next interview question to prepare for is, tell me about a time when you worked as part of a team to complete a challenging task. At Mersey Rail, you will regularly face challenges as a team and you will be expected to handle each challenge in a positive, forward thinking and collaborative manner. Now my advice, when you answer any behavioural or competency based interview question like this one, and a competency based interview question tends to start with, tell me about a time or explain a time, describe a situation when, any question like that, use the STAR method. So the STAR method or STAR technique stands for S for situation. What was the situation you found yourself in? T is for task. What was the task that needed to be carried out? A is for action. What action did you take to achieve the task? And finally, R is for result. What was the end result following your actions? So let's take a look at a top scoring answer using the STAR technique to structure our answer. So here we go. Tell me about a time when you worked as part of a team to complete a challenging task. In my previous employment, my team was tasked with coordinating the yearly charity event in aid of the company's chosen charity. In previous years, the finance team had taken responsibility for the event. However, this year, this had not been possible, so it fell to my team to take on this new challenge. Despite none of us having fundraising experience, I saw this as a fantastic opportunity to demonstrate my organisational skills. It was our task to decide what form the charity event would take, as well as when and where it would take place. I took it upon myself to schedule a team discussion to navigate the logistics of the event. As a team, we mind mapped ideas and collectively decided on a bake sale. Because each of us on the team was willing to bake and donate a large cake, we would not need to spend company money on supplies. This meant a larger sum of money could be donated. In order to maximise how much money we could make, I suggested that we make the decision to host the sale over the office lunch break. Thanks to our collective efforts as a team, we were able to raise over £800 for a worthwhile charity. Upon receiving our donation, our company received a letter of appreciation personally written by the charity's chairman. Okay, let's take a look at the next Mersey Rail interview question, which is where do you see yourself in five years time? The hiring manager is asking you this question for two reasons. Number one, they want to know that you want to work for their talk for the long term. And number two, they also want to know that you're ambitious and you have a vision for your professional development and in turn will add value to their train operating company. So here is a great example answer to help you. Where do you see yourself in five years time? 
In five years, I see myself progressing within the company to be the point where not only am I well respected in the role by my peers, but I've also taken on further responsibilities and developed professionally. I believe that in five years, I'll have proved myself as an invaluable member of the team. I intend to accomplish this by advancing my knowledge and skills, taking on new challenges and opportunities, and cultivating close bonds with my co-workers and clients. In addition, I would also take great pleasure in assisting in the training and development of newer colleagues who join the company. I am dedicated to the company's mission and core principles and I hope to contribute to its success in the long run. Now in preparation for your Mersey Row interview, I also recommend you prepare answers to the following questions. Why do you want to work for Mersey Row? Tell me about a time when you needed to communicate a difficult decision. What was the issue and what made the decision difficult? Are you aware of the company values and can you tell me about them? That's really important you get that right. What is your biggest weakness? That's a tough one. What are your main strengths that will help you to be competent in this role? Describe a time when you disagreed with a coworker. Wow, that's a tough one. Tell me the three main things that you would bring to the role if successful. How would you deal with conflict with a coworker? As you're aware, this role is extremely demanding and challenging. Tell me about a situation when you worked hard to achieve a difficult task whilst under pressure. How would you deal with a difficult or frustrated customer? What would you consider when dealing with them and why? Describe a situation when you delivered excellent customer service. Can you describe a time when you demonstrated flexibility in the workplace? And finally, please provide an example of the types of procedures that you adhere to within your working day currently and what do you think you will find most challenging about the role? So the next thing to do, if you'd like to download example answers to all of those questions I just listed, plus all of the other toughest Mersey Row interview questions, is to please make sure you click that button in the top right hand corner of this video right now, head through to my website site howtobecome.com where you can download these slides and get access to 35 Mersey Row interview questions and high scoring answers to each question in a PDF guide. You can literally have access and the slides within your inbox within two minutes from now and it's guaranteed to help you prepare effectively for your interview and also more importantly put you ahead of the competition. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Please don't forget to subscribe as I'm on a mission to help as many people as possible pass their job interviews and I can only do that if you are subscribed. Please also hit that like button as that encourages me to make more videos just like these. If you have any questions regarding any job interview with Mersey Rail, please do let me know the name of the role in the comment section below where I can get back to you with even more advice and interview tips. And finally, don't forget to connect with me on LinkedIn. I've put my LinkedIn link in the description below. It's always great to connect with like-minded professionals such as yourself. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best for your interview. Have a great day.